Hi everyone, welcome to today's trade of the day and for today's trade of the day, I will be looking at pound cat. Right, so pound cat over here, I have it on the 4 hours because uh, there's a very interesting there's a very interesting intraday setup. Okay, so we see that uh, price on the 4 hours has been basing at this low, right? So we can just quickly put our support at this level. All right, just a long-term support sort of thing. And at the same time, we see a very distinct um, behavior, right? Price has been making lower lows, okay? And every time price comes back to make a lower low, right? Price will test the 78.60 level, okay? So price is always testing the 78.60. It goes down, comes back up, test the 78.60. It goes down, comes back up. And again, we have it at the 78.60. So this is a very clear uh, 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 short-term uh, descending trend. Now where we can expect price to go is we can expect price to at least play down to this low over here, right? This is a very strong zone. Okay, anywhere within this zone, right, is acceptable for, for me. Right, anywhere in this zone is acceptable for me. So long longer term price could push down to this area all right uh, but this is the long-term take profit let's quickly go down to the one hour okay on the one hour this is what we have we can like I mentioned this highs okay can connect them together with a trend line descending trend line resistance okay one touch two three four five very strong we also see this completed movement we can do a Fibonacci retracement from the low to the high and let's open up all Fibonacci ratios Right, we actually have a key 61.8 over here, uh, intraday take profit if you would have it. All right, at a 61.8 level. So just remember that. All right, so we can actually play down, right, all the way down to anywhere within this zone. Okay, with this as an intraday take profit. Now, the key is to look for an entry, right? I'm thinking price could very well come back to test this descending trendline resistance. All right, or at least test a graphical overlap support at around the 3820 level, right? So if it's a bit harder to see, I'm going to zoom in here, right? You have the 3820 at this graphical overlap support in close, All right? So back to candlestick, All right? And just tidy this up, All right? So 3820, just remember that, okay? Uh, and this can be our entry level. Okay, why I'm waiting at this level is because uh, I'm thinking the reaction could have really been done at this trend line. But sometimes price does come back, right, to the graphical overlap. Like you see the reaction was done, but price came back, right, to this to this area over here. Okay, so price could come back and very quickly, okay, uh, the stop loss will just be outside of market structure somewhere over here. A bit higher, this entire zone is a uh, market structure. Okay, so we put our stop loss a bit beyond so to prevent ourselves from being prematurely stopped out. Now this gives a very nice risk reward trade of more than one is to two. Okay, even if price only goes to our partial take profit level here, right? It's still about one is to two. So this is quite a good setup. Last but not least, we can also put in stochastics. We see that price is that stochastics is testing uh, intermediate resistance. Every time stochastic comes to test this intermediate resistance, price drops, comes close price drops come close okay we can expect price to drop from here as well all right so thanks everyone for tuning in to today's trade of the day wish you guys all the best trade safe stay safe and i'll catch you guys again